Derek Carr is bidding farewell to the Raiders fan base, sending a half-failed message to his first NFL team amid speculation is played as last down for the silver and black. In a half-failed tweet, Derek Carr says, Raider Nation, it breaks my heart I didn't get an opportunity to say goodbye in person. We certainly have been on a roller coaster in our nine years together. From the bottom of my heart, I am so grateful and appreciative of the years of support you gave to my family and me. We had our share of both heartbreaking moments and thrilling game-winning drives, and it always felt like you were next to me. It is especially hard to say goodbye because I can honestly say that I gave you everything I had every single day in season and in the off-season. It certainly wasn't perfect, but I hope that I was able to leave you with more than a few great memories as Raiders fans. Derek Carr also added, saying, Thank you to the city of Oakland for taking us in. Thank you to the city of Las Vegas for allowing us to proudly call you home. Thank you to the organization, my teammates, all my coaches, staff, and everyone that helped me these nine years in those two buildings. Thanks to all of Raider Nation that supported, encouraged, pushed, and uplifted me at different times along this journey. Raider Nation truly is special. I once said that if I'm not a Raider, I would rather be at home and I meant that, but I never envisioned it ending this way. The fire burning inside of me to win a championship still rages. A fire no man can extinguish, only God. So I look forward to a new city and a new team who, no matter the circumstance, will get everything I have. Winning a championship is what I've always wanted and, w and what I will continue to work towards. God bless you all with love, DC4. The Raiders benched their car in favor of Jerry Stidham for the last two games of the 2022-2023 season, and he was not with the team during that period. After all that, all signs pointed to a breakup. The Raiders have to make a decision on Derek Carr early in the offseason as his base salary for 2023 and part of 2024 is due to become fully guaranteed three days after the Super Bowl. Derek Carr is set to earn $32.9 million as part of the three-year extension which was signed in April runs through 2025 and he will be guaranteed $7.5 million for the following season if he remains on the roster on February 15th. If the Raiders can't find a trade partner, the Raiders can simply release their car with minimal penalty. The route would cost the team approximately $5 million in debt cap space, but it would save over $29 million against the cap for the 2023 season. Derek Carr has spent his entire pro career with the Raiders, playing in 142 regular season games. The Raiders selected Derek Carr in the second round of the 2014 draft, and he went on to accumulate 35,222 passing yards, 217 touchdowns, and 99 interceptions. The Raiders made the playoffs twice during Derek Carr's time, but did not earn a postseason victory. A veteran quarterback does have a no-trade clause in his contract, allowing him to have a say in the trade discussions. Las Vegas could seek a deal before the Super Bowl, but it wouldn't become official until the new league year begins in March.